we no longer live in a world where women can say stock market is none of our business. A similar anecdote was used by me, unaware that women of today play a pivotal role in laying the framework for key financial decision making. Hello everyone, I'm Maria Marcel, representing Bangalore Chapter. Heartily welcome you all to this dynamic forum where learning and thinking is going to make a critical shift. In my journey here, I was metamorphosed into a confident, wise investor. Under the constant guidance of Sir Dhanuka and his concepts on value investing that have been extremely impactful and worthwhile in shaping my investment journey. In my time here, I was reassured that the most important investment that you will make is in yourself. Joining IIY has been the best decision I've made. Um, the learning from ET on a daily basis, having Sir decipher it for us, uh, what it means to us as investors, I think this has been so helpful for me personally. Um, even the conclaves that we attend and are part of, uh, the latest one being the agrochemical conclave, I think it was fantastic learning with the speakers, uh, learning from Sir on a one-on-one -on -one in person basis. So I think it's been an excellent journey and I don't think I ever want to discontinue this learning. In IIY classes, Sir breaks down the concept of financial terms in the most simplest form thereby making it easy for us whenever we are reading anything about finance, be it newspapers, be it magazine, or be it company's financial statements, and so on and so forth. IIY classes has given me three C's, and they are clarity, confidence, and competence. Some of the most impactful lessons that we have learned and we remember are the lessons that were taught to us in very simple words, in a very simple format. That's exactly what happened when in Millennium Ma'am we were taught to how to read the balance sheet and the profit and loss accounts for companies. The way it was formatted was very simple and the information was exactly what we needed and we just picked up what we wanted and not too much information was you know, kept in there. It really helped us to look at companies in a much simpler way. As an investor, that was a game changer. Success of a business is not to be measured by its fame and wealth, but by different financial ratios. This mantra is very minutely taught by Sir Dhanuka. Under his guidance, we learnt about many ratios like P-E ratio, debt-equity ratio, current ratio, quick ratio. Now we can confidently use these tools to evaluate the performance of a company.